Hi guys, I am vlogging and it is another day in Maui. I am wearing a shirt. <laughs> and um, another day in Maui. I just really wanted to share this experience with you guys. We've been here for about three months. You can check out the video of we moved to Maui. I'll um, link it down below. But yeah, we moved here and I just love it so much. I really want to share the joy and the experience with you guys. So I am currently here in Kahului, which is like our main town area. I just got this one. Hi, Quinn. <laughs> I got that one a nail trimming and it's about a 35 minute drive away from home and that's like our only Target and Peko on the island so um, I'm gonna run some errands real quick and get a few things at Target and then head back to the other side of the island we live on the west side so yeah whenever you come down here because it has kind of like everything that you need like Walmart Target um, Petco what else do they have Lowe's all that's in this mid middle part of the island and then on our side of the island they just have like grocery stores and like little small shops so in some ways it can be inconvenient but it is it is what it is so today I'm gonna get a few things and then if it's anything cool I'll show you guys around Target I mean I'll show you what I got from Target but if not I'm gonna head home and do a Amazon haul for you guys I haven't shopped in a while so I got a few cool things a few outfits hair like accessories and some other stuff so yeah I will check in in a little bit say hi Quinn say hi. hello hello oh. From Target I'm actually super super exhausted so I made myself a matcha tea in a honey from leftover honey so I just like put matcha warm milk some ice and then shaked up the matcha inside of it and it made like a matcha a cold matcha and we're using the cup but anyways this is so such in a weird spot but I wanted to get out of the way and then we have boxes because we're still unpacking. Our stuff just arrived yesterday after three months of living here. It's a long story. But anyways, um, I wanted to show you guys what I got from Amazon. And did I say please excuse the bathroom? Bathroom? <laughs> Background and bathroom. Please excuse the bathroom. The first thing I got is I've been really into these like hair clips I came in like a pack of eight I think and it came with a variety of colors like I have these white this a white clip well I can't talk this white clip this pink clip black green and then clear and then brown and black and it, I think it was only like eight dollars or something these ones kind of suck they don't like grip as much as other clips do like these but i really want to get like extra long clips because my hair is so thick and so it really helps you know keep all my hair up but anyways yeah so i really like this like uh these clips and for that many oh for that many i feel like that was a good price like eight dollars or something so i really like that next i got oh I'll tell you later. I think I already showed you. Next, I got these earrings that I'm wearing right now. Like that. They're really cool because they look like they're like a whole piercing, but all they are is just one little like piercing like this, but the bar goes around your earlobe. So, it looks like that. I really like that. And it's from the company Pavoy. Again, very affordable, gold plated. A really good price. And then I got some face masks. These are like the cream run, the cream ones. And I think there are, gosh, I think 20 something dollars, 20 something of these face masks. And it was only, it was such a good price. And I've used this brand before, so I really like it. I'm gonna share some with my daughter as well. But I think it's like 
20 something for like $15 or whatnot. But there's a charcoal. There's like collagen, coconut, coffee, green tea, aloe. So stuff like that. I'm going to split with her. And then I... Hi, Amy. And then I also got some sunglasses. Two pairs of sunglasses, but I wasn't sure which one I should keep. So you guys help me decide which ones I should keep. Who's this? Oh, and then also I got this these two gold-plated rings. I really wanted just some like plain gold bands, and I love because I always like go in the water all the time, and I hate wearing my wedding band in it. So. I wanted to wear these gold ones and they're gold plated and I can put them in the water, I can swim with them in the ocean and I really just like how they look, very minimal and I'm kind of into gold jewelry. Amy, hi. Good boy. Hi, Mimi. Okay, so I'm gonna be right back. I wanna um, get my other sunglasses and let me know what you guys think, which sunglasses I should keep or not, but I'll be right back. Okay, so these are the two sunglasses I got. I bought from Amazon. I don't know which one I will keep. I'll probably, I think I'll keep the green ones, but you guys let me know what you think. I like them because these are like a subtle like olive green. I don't know if you're going to be able to see in this lighting. But yeah, and sometimes it looks black. And I like it because it has like the oversized look. You can wear it a little bit lower like that. And they're not your typical black. They're your green sunglasses. They're oversized. So let me know if you guys like these sunglasses. Or the next ones that I'm going to show you. And guys, I haven't been buying a lot. I haven't bought things in like forever. And I've been going on like this kind of like thing about over consumerism. And you know, I have waited, gosh, several months since I shopped. So um, I just needed a few things because we were living out of our luggage for three months. And I was getting tired of wearing the same seven clothes over and over again. So I did order a couple outfits and then some sunglasses and hair clips. It's not much. And then finally our stuff came. And so, yeah, I don't know if I need to keep this stuff, but I probably will. Okay, so let me know what you guys think about these sunglasses. They're kind of like... I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about them. Every time everybody, sometime, somebody else wears it, they look really good with it. But for me, I'm not sure. I mean, I like it, but are they too small for my head? They're kind of like smaller oval glasses, and I've always wanted glasses like this. So let me know what you guys think. Do you like this one, or do you like... Or do you like this one? Or maybe I should keep both because they're super affordable and I like lose my sunglasses all the time. I don't know. You guys tell me. Okay, so I got that. And lastly, no not lastly, I have a few more things. This one, I am so, 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 so excited to share with you guys. This is the Manifestation Journal and Calendar. It says, be the energy that you want to attract. And oh my gosh, I haven't used it yet. It's a calendar from September. It's like an 18-month calendar. So it has the horoscope on there. And it's like this tan color. And uh, once I know more about it, I'll definitely talk to you guys about it. But it just has like your manifestation, like goals and tips. And then it's also like a daily calendar. So I haven't started using it. It has like the gold, rose gold on the side. I'm really excited because 
I just have so much going on with the three kids that I definitely need to start writing it down more instead of on my phone. And also, I really want to focus on manifesting a huge goal within the next, hopefully, year to 18 months. So I feel like writing it down and kind of like putting my intentions in place will really keep me motivated. So ah, I love this and I'm going to tell you guys more about it in a future video. Okay, next I have some outfits and these are so cute. Am I going to try it on for you guys? I'm not sure, but I think I will. Okay, so I got this like two piece pants. I got these like two piece like uh, hunter green pants. So cute. They're linen and it has like a little, a big slit actually on the side. And then the top is cropped a little bit and I just think it's so cute and so comfy for this hot weather here. So cropped like that. I'll insert a picture maybe and then I'll put on some matcha. And then I got the tie-dye like matching outfit so these are like spandex but instead of it being like a colorful tie-dye they're like white and black and gray tie-dye kind of is it tie-dye i don't know not really it's like a smoky look and then it has like a matching shirt and i thought this would just be casual like a chill outfit like going around the island at home you know doing errands and stuff like that and then the last one i want to show you Real quick. The last one was inspired by Natalie from, not inspired, she had a really cute outfit, Natalie from Modi Chain, I think that's her Instagram and YouTube, and basically she had like a two-piece like hunter green outfit and it was so cute. If I can find it, I'll post it. And they don't deliver to Hawaii, and I think they're, they're sold out or something. So I found something similar. It's in like this cream color. It's an oversized like linen shirt, and you kind of leave it like open or oversized or tucked halfway tucked in, and then you have the shorts that go with it. Yeah, so I'm gonna try these on real quick. Let me know what you guys think. Should I keep them? I think I'm definitely gonna keep them, but I just can't decide between the sunglasses. So I'll be right back and then try it on and show you guys. Okay, so this is that first outfit. I really, really like this outfit so much. It's so cute. I don't know if I... <sighs> Can you see the whole thing? I hope so. And it kind of opens like this. Love this outfit, like, a lot. It's so cute. So yeah, I think this is just perfect for Hawaii. I'm sure for like, you guys are coming out with fall, this would be perfect for fall, I think. And then you could even put like something like a little cover up. But I love, love, love this outfit so much. This is definitely a win. And it's so comfortable, I can wear it around the house and stuff. So let me do the next one. This one's so cute too. It's just very casual. And it is just matching bottom and top. Very, very casual spandex like that. And yeah, this is kind of just like very casual with my hair up and a clip like this. And I could, you know, run errands, go grocery shopping, stay at home, and it's just very comfortable. Super comfortable. They have like different colors as well. Okay, this one is a little bit more tomboyish. I think but I really like it like tucked in like this on the side you know wear a crossbody bag you got the shorts on I think that even like don't mind the bra but if I had like a crop top underneath I could put a little like crop top and just wear it like this but I think most of the time I'll just wear it like so it's very long top and I had to go oversized because I ordered it once before in a different color and it was way too tight and small. So I think I ordered this like in a large um, and it does look big but then when you get the other size they, they look too small. So I think this is very fun too. So yeah, 
uh, let me know what you guys think. That was pretty much my Amazon haul, I think. <laughs> I'm wearing my shorts that I got today. I'm so sweaty right now. <laughs> Aloha. <laughs> Aloha. Oh, look how cute that little van is. I see that guy everywhere. Oh, wow, that is cute. So I haven't filmed in a really long time, so forgive me if it feels very awkward. I, I, have, I don't think I filmed in like two or three months. Oh, wow, it's been a while, huh? Oh, no, no. I filmed like a sit-down video, but a vlog. Yeah. So, JT, man, I wish I would have vlogged so much in this past two month, months because we've done so many exciting things, but... It was kind of to the point where I was enjoying it so much that I just wanted to sh cherish it with us instead of, you know. But today is JT and I first date night. Yeah. And without kids. And, well, actually, we went on a date lunch last week. Yeah. To the plantation house. And yeah. That was super fun for my birthday. But today we're going to go eat at Mana. Or Mala. Oh, Mala? Mala. The ocean house. So it's going to be very exciting. Um, I always see it and I didn't. Like, I didn't know what it was. I will see brunch, so it's going to be exciting to go check it out for dinner. So we'll vlog a little bit there, maybe. And, um... Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> I, I hate vlogging with my phone. I don't know how people vlog with their phone. What happened to the camera? Um, I could... I don't know. I didn't think about vlogging, but I was like, I want to start vlogging. But the camera's quality, don't you think, on a camera, on the iPhone, sucks? I'm not a fan of the iPhone. Yeah, I agree. JT put me on the street side as a peasant instead of the over the ocean side. <laughs> mm. Not bad, eh? Mm, that's really nice. How is it? Oh, that's so good. Ooh, that's candy. We're standing by the the views of the ocean. What do you think? This is a restaurant here. It has a big little tree right there. Really and sexy then turn tree. around. Oh. And then Don't this is up. our view right now. Oh my gosh, you look so handsome. Aw, I love bad. you. Not too shabby. No, not too shabby at all. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That's what you get here. Oh, look at those waves rolling in too. What do you think of it so far? Oh, I love it. Um, Supposedly, it's a, one of the best restaurants on the island, you know. So, uh, but we had the calamari so far. It was okay. I'd say, yeah. I mean, it's, it's you know, heavy. yeah. But and then, then the, the calamari was uh, French. That's but then they had the fish of the day, so you know they're out of that. So we're gonna give it a try with something else. So Mahi. that's exciting. Yeah. But yeah. Thank <laughs> you. Got the ube something. The ube, the ube and rum. Ooh, it's the ube baby baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's okay. I'm just joking. You know. Maybe this is sort of like a stream. Yeah. Hey guys, so I am back home and yeah, I just changed into my house clothes and I wanted to show you guys something really quickly. This necklace I got, um, but I'll show you in a little bit. But yeah, overall the restaurant that we went to, the ambiance was really nice because it was right on the water. It's in our little town that we live at. And, but the food, to be honest, 
The calamari, it was very fresh, the texture, but it didn't have enough seasoning and the sauce was okay. I'm not trying to be naysayer, but like if you want to go eat there, I would say the ambiance is the best part and the manager, Jesus, and our server was awesome, but, and the views were awesome. We got to watch the sunset and the clams needed to be more seasoned more. The drinks were pretty decent. I got the ube like um, drink and the guava drink. And then um, dinner was a mahi with like shiitake mushrooms. And that was actually pretty good. So overall, I would say like the place was okay, but the ambiance was amazing. So if you want really good ambiance, definitely go there. Okay, so let me show you my necklace. I just got this. I've been searching for this sunrise necklace. It is basically a seashell that's rare to find and you can find it in Hawaii and sometimes you can find it in North Shore like washed up but for the most part you have to go deep diving for it to get it so a lot of people scuba dive for it of course the shells are no longer have a living creature in it so yeah I just got that I have been looking high and low for this necklace and everything kind of ranged between like I would say 65 was the cheapest that I saw in Maui and then 100 something plus but I actually found this on Etsy and it's gold plated and I found it for $45 and it actually has like little pearls at the, t at the clips too so that's cool for $45 and actually the girl that makes these necklaces she's from Kailua where um, we lived in Oahu so I really wanted to support her so here's her card if you guys are interested I would say that she customer service is pretty oh look at my eyes so look creepy <laughs> um, gypsy gypsy eye girl is where I got this from on Etsy customer service is amazing she even put in a extra like seashell pin for me um, I really, really was just very pleasantly surprised and because she shipped it here, it only took like, it was so fast and um, yeah, so she shipped me this sunrise shell and um, pin. And also say sunrise shells back in the days, only like royalty, like king and queens used to wear it long time ago Hawaiian king and queen or queen excuse me and then also it was also just like a super rare like royalty type of shell so I really really like that and it's just so beautiful I honestly wanted to get the green version but those are kind of hard to find so I want to go stick with this and I'm going to swim with it and probably not take it off but I just feel like such a mermaid with it so I figured I'd share that with you guys but yeah, I bought it with my own money, definitely not sponsored or sent or anything, but I wanted to share my experience with you. Okay guys, we don't need to fight. Um, so, I just wanted to show you guys real quick, I'm not going to vlog for long, but I wanted to show you that Maui, if you're here in Maui or you like Chick-fil-A a lot, um, Hawaii hasn't had Chick-fil-A in forever and they just opened the Maui location now. And so, yeah, so excited.